Hello, this is a video showing you how to get Zelkard on the second try, which is quite a bit easier than the first try. All that the second try requires that you do early Quisis card manipulation. So that's covered in another video or tutorial. I'm not going to go over too much here. Um, just know that you will either get one of three patterns, an Elastoid, a Malboro, or Biggs and Wedge. Keep a track of that, put it in the program, it's important. Once you've done that, at any point you can click submit and this window down here will appear. But you don't need to worry about this way past like an hour until you fought Diablos. So if you're going for second card, you want to do this after Diablos because it makes the games much easier and you're guaranteed to win. So I've just fought Diablos, I'm back in town now. So let's go and get Zelkard. At the bottom right it shows me all the cards I need to pick and then the order to play them in. and this is the advantage of Diablo's card, there's only two patterns, one for each initiative. Okay, so now we go speak to his mom, you don't need to be fast here at this point, you don't need to worry, but now is when the manip starts, it says please hit play with turbo button. Now we're not allowed turbo in NA, but you don't need turbo for this. As long as you can mash relatively quickly, you're probably going to get this. It's way less tight of a window than um, Quistus card manipulation. So if you can get Quistus card manipulation, good job, you've done the hard part. So just mash your heart out when you press X here. So I'm going to do that with turbo just to make this consistent. Okay. Now I'm going to play the cards that it tells me to play. And here's what we get. So at the start we need to tell the program what's going on. So we either start with a plus or a minus. So if we go first we start with a plus, plus for initiative, minus, they've got initiative. So I went first. Now I need to enter the enemy's cards, uh, the card values. So this is done top, left, right, bottom. So for the first card, this bug bite, it's 1533, three, so I'll type that in, 1533. Three. And then you can put spaces, or you, not spaces, but you can put commas and periods here if you want, if it helps you spread it out. So 3345.2414, for example. Um, I'm just going to do it the way that I normally do it. You do not need separators. So 1533, 3345, 2414, 7427, 5637. Then hit enter. It's found where we are in the RNG. So now we just complete the game as it says at the bottom right. So I go first. So this pattern will always work. Okay. So this is the battle that we'll now get cell card on. Let me explain what's going to happen. So if I press enter here, the timer starts and pretty soon we'll start seeing asterisks move across and when they hit this little uh, exclamation mark, that's when we want to uh, start the game. So there are two text boxes of course, we need to press yes here and then once we've done that we need to press X again to actually play the game. And this times when we need to press that second box. So you can do this as much as you want, it's not going to cause issues. But what we need to do is the easiest way to do this is press X on your controller and enter on your keyboard at the exact same time. And do that again when you stop it. So I'm going to press X to start it. And when I see this hit, I'm going to press Enter and X at the same time. So I've done that. I play the exact same cards. And I don't get... And I don't get cell card. That's unfortunate. Oh well, luckily we've got a backup. 6726, 4467, 6211, 6554, 764. So I was actually a little bit too fast. Um, I'm minus 5 off where I want to be. So let's just do this game as we would normally do it. 
Oops. So for its second try, you can keep chaining this. So this isn't an issue. We're still we can still manipulate this for the third game. So let's try a little bit better on the third game, see if we can actually get it. So enter next at the same time. Enter an X at the same time. Uh, and there's Zell card. Now, obviously, I could just get Zell card here, but I'm going to show you that you can keep chaining this, and this will really help you practice. So, I can do the exact same thing as I did for my backup that I just did, but the A for Zell card will be a zero. So, I'm going to type them all in. So. I, she went first, so minus. 8650-2531-6211-1764. So it's seen that Zell card's there. So I should really take it, but this is practice. We're not going to take it. So mom's got first. From bar center left. So I won the game, I'm not going to pick Zell card though. Just for exp uh, explanation. And I can battle her again. Did the exact same thing that I've shown you. Start them at the same time. Stop them at the same time. That was a bit too soon so I might not get it. This is why the practice is good because it lets you see what you're doing wrong. So red black fungoir. So I was lucky, Zelkar did appear. So we'll do this one more time just to showcase it. So minus both at the same time. This is pretty soon. But if you're too worried, you can leave it. You don't need to get it on the first time around. Or the second time around. You can just keep letting it go. So I'll get it this time. And there's self guard. So easy as that. your shiny new Zell card and continue your run. This does not rely on step count, this does not rely on RNG tracking whatsoever, we're telling the program what the RNG is by doing all these card entries. So this is pretty free and I hope it helps you out.